Matt here, and today I've got my 1943 Mazda to go in, and I'm going to be uh, planking off some 24 inch steel targets and uh, seeing at least how far I can get out with just the iron sights on this thing. Uh, my front post is way off. I think I figured out how to compensate for it. I've been trying to adjust it. But uh, I gotta, I still gotta do some studying on this rifle. I haven't had it very long, and uh, my knowledge on it isn't that great or extensive. So I'll move this over anyway. Um, like I said, um, I'm gonna do another review on the gun itself. Uh, but I'm gonna wait until I get my camera back. That's got my macro mode on it, so I can show you some of the features on it. Anyway, uh, we're going to start out with the 100, try to go to the 200, the 300, maybe the 400 or so. So, we'll get that. Alrighty. I'm going to try out this 100 yard plate real quick. Like I said, the sights on this are just a little bit off, so we're going to see if I can compensate for it. Didn't see that. There we go. Now we're going to see if we can try to tag that one at 200 yards. I don't know if you can see it out there, but it's the second berm over. 100 yard berm. And then the 200 yard, the 24 inch plate. So let's see if we can hit that. That was on the money for a shot. Alright. So we'll try out 300 for a couple of shots and then I want to pop a couple of that, that 500 yard board. So, try it real quick. You know the wind picking up, so.
let's move out. That last little board way out there. That came pretty damn close. Well, the sights are off, but hey, what can you do? I'll tell you what, it's still a fun damn rifle to shoot. And if you're actually shooting at someone iron sights that far away, I think that's pretty. Uh, well, it's close enough to scare the shit out of them, so. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys.